As part of this topic, let us understand how to load data into Spark Metastore tables. We can load either from local file system or from HDFS. For local file system, we'll be using slash data slash retail DB to actually load data from retail DB tables such as orders. We have subfolder called as orders and we'll be using it. We have already seen in the past. For HDFS, we'll be using slash public slash retail underscore db and we have uh, folders for each and every table related to our retail db data set first let's review that and uh, you need to make sure that you understand the difference between local file system and hdfs so the local file system location is nothing but slash data retail db orders for our orders data set the hdfs location is nothing but slash public slash retail db slash orders so these are the locations which we'll be using. There's a typo in orders, that's why it is not showing the file. Still, there is some other issue. We should not be using ls-ltr here. It should be hdfs dfs-ls. And you should be able to see the files under this location, which is nothing but part-50. You can see that size of both the files is same. Now let's get into this and take it further. As we have already validated, the files now it is time for us to get into the details with respect to loading data into the tables when it comes to data and table both should be in sync if they are not sync even though it will not throw any error when we actually load data into the table you will start seeing incorrect results when you try to query that table at a later point in time that being said we need to create the table with the same file format and delimiters so that we can load the data in files into spark metastore tables if the file format which we are trying to load into the table is different from the file format specified while creating the table then uh, you might not see the errors however you will start seeing the incorrect results when you run queries such as select on top of the table when it comes to our data which is there both in a local file system as well as in hdfs which we will be using to load into the spark metastore table they are of text file format that's why if we go into this location data retail underscore db orders and if we say view and then give the file name you will be seeing all alphanumeric characters if it is a non-text file format then you will be seeing binary characters which is not readable typically that being said as our file is in text file format our table also should be in text file format that is the case in all our create table statements so far you can actually see here there is no stored as clause which means by default it is going to create with text file format on top of the file format you also need to take care of line delimiter field delimiter etc if it is a simple delimited data set for that you can actually go here and again open the file and you can see that the line delimiter is new new line character in this case in this file each record is there in line and at the end you have a new line character within each record the attributes are separated using comma so the field delimiter is comma and the line delimiter is new line character which is default when it comes to hive so we don't need to specify explicitly with respect to line delimiter however with respect to field delimiter we need to make sure that comma is specified and that is the case here so using this first let us uh, try to create the table and then if you want to copy the files from local file system such as data retail db orders so this is the location it is a folder and it, it have one file it can have n number of files however all the files should be of same structure otherwise it will not uh, work typically you will not run into any issues while loading the data but when you try to query you will see the incorrect results that being said assuming that whatever files are there as part of this folder satisfies the table structure which is defined while creating the table we should be able to use that path and we can use load data local local stands for local file system in path and you have to specify the local file system path which is nothing but data retail db orders if you want you can even specify the file name here but it is not a good practice we typically pass the folder name and then we can say into table orders then the data will be copied into the table 